Hi, I'm Sheila. Hi, I'm Eileen. And today we're going to show you how to use highlighter and where to put it. The whole reason I like to use highlighter is to finish a look. I like to put it at the, at the end as a finishing touch. Um, to me, it completes a look. It gives you a nice candle lit, lit from within look. Um, it looks like a candle is following you around all day. It's really nice and romantic. Um, so there's different types that you can use. You can buy drugstore brands, really cheaper brands like e.l.f. I bought this online. It was like 50% off. So it was like a dollar fifty, and that's their studio line. So it comes in a palette. There's white. There's peach. There is a champagne color, and there's also like a nice pink. You can use it for anything. You can use it um, for like a lip gloss, eyeshadow, whatever. But I like to use it as a highlighter. And it's really fun to use. You just use your fingers. It comes with a tiny brush, but I don't really use that because it's just too tiny. Um, shimmer also comes, uh, highlighter also comes in like a mousse form. This is another e.l.f. Um, highlighter. This is Shimmering Facial Whip. You can see we're fans of e.l.f. E.l.f., yeah. <laughs> but we do buy <laughs> more prestigious brands. Um, so this is another e.l.f. This is their um, Oliver Color Stick. And this is my favorite. This is NARS, the multiple in Copa Cabana. And it's huge. It'll last you forever. Amazing. And it's like a, I don't know, like a champagne-y, shimmery highlighter. And then, of course, highlighter also comes in powder form. This is another one of e.l.f.'s products. This is their Healthy Glow Bronzing Powder, but it's a really light color. So um, I use it as a highlighter instead of a bronzer. And this is Max Mineralized Skin Finish in Medium Dark and Natural and Shimmer. Um, it's really nice and natural, and there's like the shimmery one on top. Well, I think the bottom one's pretty shimmery too, but you can use a combination of both. And this is Smashbox's Eye Beam Double Ended Brightener. There's two ends. This one is for your eyes, and this one is for your brow, brow bone. They're pretty much the same color, um, so you can use, it doesn't matter which side you use. This one I would put like the inner corner of your eye, and this one for your brow bone. And it came in like a kit I got for Christmas from my boyfriend. <laughs> um, and highlighter also comes in um, loose powder. This is Avon's Lightness Luminous Face and Body Powder. It's really loose. Um, I would just use this for my body if I'm going out to like a wedding or a clubbing or whatever. And to apply your highlighters, you can use brushes like a fan brush. This is Essence of Beauty, they're double-ended ones. Um, this is like a, like a blending brush and this is um, just like a flat brush. It's really tiny so I like to use it for contouring and highlighting. So we're going to use it for highlighting today. Um, so now I'm going to show you where to put the highlighter. You want to put it on the high points of your face because when the light hits you or the camera flash hits you, it really brings out like your, your facial structure. Um, so you would want to use highlighter, highlighter on the parts that you want to bring out. And then if you're doing contouring, you can use a bronzer or a contour powder to like, say if you want like really sucked in cheeks, you can put the bronzing powder here and the highlighter up top to make you look really chiseled. So, the first place I like to put it is on the cheekbones to really bring out your cheeks. So, I'm going to use my NARS, my NARS um, the multiple, and just one swipe to the top of the cheekbones. Really simple to use, and you just blend it in. It really gives you a nice, dewy, healthy look. And then, um, I'm going to show you the, the eye pencil. I'm going to follow the directions and use the eye for the inner corner of the eyes. And do just on the inner corners. And it really gives your eyes like a really nice, wide awake, fresh look. And this side is for your brow bone. I like to put it like right underneath your eyebrow on the outer corner. Like that. There you go. Um, and as for the powder, I'm going to use Elf's powder. 
You can use a fan brush like I said, but for more control I'm going to use a smaller brush. You don't want to put highlighter all over your face, that defeats the purpose and you'll look really shiny. <laughs> so, <laughs> no just use it sparingly. So I'm just going to tap this into here and then dust it on the bridge of her nose. Really lightly, you don't want to put too much because then you look like you have a shiny nose. But this helps to make you look like you have a stronger nose. So that's that. You can also use, I forgot to mention, um, eyeshadow. If you don't have any shimmer, if you don't, uh, I mean highlighter, if you don't want to go out and buy it, you really need it. You can just use any shimmery, like light eyeshadow, like this one. This is Physicians Formula Baked Butter Collection. Or you can use, like this is my um, Coastal Sense Warm Palette. Um, and you can use any of these um, light colors. You can use gold silver, white, or cream. Um, you can use matte or shimmery. It doesn't matter as long as it brings out what you want to bring out. I also like to put some highlighter on the cupid's bow, like right um, at the top of your upper lip. That helps to make your lips really pouty and make it more defined. brings more attention to your lips. Um, now, Eileen has really nice full lips already. But I'm going to do it anyway just to show you guys. I'm going to use ELF's Shimmering Facial Whip. What color is this? This is... I don't know what color this is. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, yeah. This is Light Petal. So oh. it's kind of a pinkish hue. I mean, if it comes with different colors, don't be scared to put it on your face. It doesn't really show up the color. Mm. Um, it's just like the shimmer that shows up. So I would just like to dab it on like, the Cupid's bow. <laughs> and that just makes your lips pop even more. And that's about it. Um, I like to use highlighter a lot, like for everyday looks. It just makes me look even more awake. Um, but if you're going for a really like matte look, I wouldn't use it. Um, I would use like a matte high, like a matte shadow if you want to bring out your features. Um, but that's it. So thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.